the most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It is Olympic Marseille. They take on Borussia Dortmund. And the action is next on EA TV Live. And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Stuart Robson. It's Marseille facing Borussia Dortmund. Well, Derek, this is magnificent. The atmosphere inside this stadium is electric. Let's just hope the tension doesn't affect the players. It shouldn't do. Just look at the quality down there. the impressive Paul Lopez between the posts. Zayad Kolasinac plays alongside Eric Bailly in central defence. And the focal point in attack today is Alexis Sanchez. for Borussia Dortmund. Niklas Zule starts with Mats Hummels in central defence. Jude Bellingham starts with Emre Can in central midfield. And the striker of choice is the powerful and lethal Sebastian Allaire. And now the Champions League final commences. Malinowski Alain On to Rice Alexis Sanchez Close Oh, good looking run He could pick out a teammate Be breathing a sigh of relief, ball one. Well, the fans are certainly having their say. Just listen to them. They thought that was a penalty. Guerrero. The ball with Marco Reus. Borussia Dortmund have given it away. Well, sheer entertainment and unpredictability offered by Dimitri Payet. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him today? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-two, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. Chance to play it in. And still looking to get the shot away. Corner coming up. They take it short. Alexis Sanchez moving in field. What can he do? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Payet. A real opening now. And he struck the post. Well, they survived the attack. Well, they're certainly getting closer. You just sense that the goal is coming. They're playing so well at the moment.
Alexis Sanchez. Tavares. Will it happen for them? Payet. What a crucial intervention inside the box. Brandt. And now waiting to pounce. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out the danger. Who's Chan? No problems grabbing hold of that one. Well, the injury will mean a stoppage. The referee going down that road, so treatment can be administered now. And back in business again with a drop ball. Running room in the wide position. And teammates to play it to. Genduzzi. Can he put them in front? Oh, the post denied him. Had a two. Still a chance. Can they stop it going in? Well, threat averted. Well, you sense the goal's coming. They're getting so close now. They just need to take one of these chances. Well, it should boost their confidence, but they can't afford to drop their guard at the other end. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Guendouzi. Alexis Sanchez. Good looking sequence. Gentusi. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Guerrero. Wolf. Sebastian Allaire. He's in with a chance. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. And Marseille get the ball rolling once more. How will they react after conceding? Could be troublesome. Well, not a great cross, making the goalkeeper's job rather easy. Well, Dortmund just can't dominate the possession, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Yes, a really effective performance all in all. Is it going to be? Well, it might still work out for them. Threat over for now, it seems. No nonsense clearance. And Bellingham. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Jonathan Close. Sanchez. Might be dangerous. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. And support available. Will they get themselves level here? And not cleared away properly. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Hummers. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital.
Sebastian Allaire. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Opportunity! And just over the bar. Really good effort. vision can he get onto this oh that is a superb save and steered back under a bit of pressure the high press was very much on well it could be on for him here oh a save of the highest order well he got his angles absolutely right what a good save that is Well, they fancy a short one. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Brandt. Özcan. Aller. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change. Over it comes. Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. Well, a corner right on the back of the last one. Superb save. Can someone get on the end of this? And well, nothing comes of it. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. No possibilities inside the box. And reading it absolutely superbly. Sanchez. And it's gone out of play under real duress. Niklas Zule. Well, Dortmund have certainly bossed the possession over the last 15 minutes and have been pressing to extend their lead. They just need to be a bit more clinical in front of goal. Sebastian Aller. Decent position for Dortmund to be in. Will it be? And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So, 2-0 now. And did well to keep hold of it while waiting for the support to arrive. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Defenders need to cover. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And the finish is just as good. 
That's an excellent goal. This is going to be a thrashing. 3-0 now. Twenty minutes to go. Matteo Guendouzi oh, showing excellent vision. It was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Brandt. He takes aim. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, not the best clearance. Save, but still a chance. And that came off the defender, so it'll be a corner. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, last line of defence, literally. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Zule. It's with Mats Hummers. Wolf. The referee has played advantage in Dortmund's favour. And Bellingham. Taking care of business defensively here. Played into the centre. And fired against the crossbar. A goal! An exceptional performance, this. Four to the good now. Well, here's the replay, and just look at his reaction to the initial shot. He's so sharp, he deserves that goal. a massive lead and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now Genghis Under back to Under and the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them nicely timed tackle Daniel Malin. He has teammates around him. And now passing it through. Oh, the referee has given it. Penalty it is. Well, no card handed out. He gets away with a rebuke. Well, a lot of referees would have booked him there. But I'm with him on this one. No yellow card for me. And a substitution in the offing. In it goes! A well-taken penalty! Well, here's the replay. And it takes a lot of courage to hit a penalty like that. The goalkeeper just moves out the way and it goes down the middle. It's an excellent execution, but always risky. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Well, by playing keep ball like this, they're keeping the opposition at bay. Dahoud. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick.
And that is goalkeeping of the very highest order. A corner will ensue. Delivering it. That's fine goalkeeping to hold on to the corner. How about this? Borussia Dortmund have only gone and won the UEFA Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners... Borussia Dortmund. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it? with your own supporters. Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe. Sebastian Allaire.